for Thanksgiving? I, I worked partially. Went home, had some nice pie. Of course, uh, we had a nice dinner with Bo Din a couple days before that. Very nice, her son. And uh, he's doing great. He's he's actually going to buy a home pretty soon. We're hoping. Um, now, I, I, I do you have time for a Howard Hughes story? Yeah. Hello. So, you know Howard Hughes lived in. He lived at the Desert Inn for four years, right? He basically. He I didn't know the name of it, but yeah, I did. Yeah, know he that. lived in the penthouse. He never left. He urinated into a mason jar, and, and they were lined up in jars all around the all around his room. Yeah, they were not cleared out until he moved out. So the situation is this: he used to watch this station, KLAS, Las Vegas, local local TV station. He didn't like the movies that they played. Then he would call the station and he would complain about the movies. So finally, in order to play the movies that he wanted, he just decided to buy the station. So basically, he just started playing those movies. Now, Bullet came out in 1968, Steve McQueen. Uh-huh. Did you see that one? I'm sure that I did. So it had just been released in the theaters. But really? he, he had a 16 millimeter flown in. So he, he, want, he wanted to see it. He didn't want to go out to a theater. He wanted to see it, so he had it flown in. And he had his television station play the movie. A new release. This is 1968. Of course, executives were calling from ABC, NBC, CBS the next day. They were saying, is, is Howard Hughes using his TV station as his personal video cassette recorder? And two weeks later, he did the same thing with Long Hot Summer. They fined him $200,000 for copyright <laughs> infringement. The guy was a billionaire. Like, he cares. You, yeah, you don't use the YouTube. Time, you don't, at the time, it seemed like a lot. You don't use YouTube. Well, if you're a billionaire, 200000 is nothing. I can do. Yeah. He used it as YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> oh, really? That makes sense. Huh. How, go on. That's it, I think. What are, so the object is, the message is. There's, the, there's no message, is, it's just, a, it's a bizarre story. That, that'd be like if Star Wars came out and some rich guy just decided to, he, he was playing it for himself. He was, it's. Right, right. The, the whole purpose of the TV station was so he could watch movies. He didn't, it's not like. He didn't have anything else to do. But that's very so interesting. Bullet and what was a long hot summer? I don't know how I like that title. I don't remember what long hot summer. I never was saw either of them. They were Bullet before. Or Steve McQueen. If I ever saw a Steve McQueen movie, that would be the one. Okay. Okay. How was your Thanksgiving? So, oh God. You know what? I it made me realize in Thanksgiving past that I like being right here with these people. Uh-huh. I, we eat the same. We know each other. We And just for every holiday that ever went amok at my mom's, anywhere I went, it, everything turned to shit. Exactly. Oh, God. And Paul and Eric and I don't know who else, not John. But they would just hog the chairs, the comfortable chairs, yeah. eat all the chips and dip <laughs> so they're full when they uh, go to Thanksgiving dinner upstairs. Or they had so much cocaine, they had no appetite whatsoever. They were doing cocaine. Were memory. they doing Were they doing cocaine in Regina's home? Oh, yes. Yeah. Who? Um, who? Mary said that she saw Eric departing out of the laundry room with a, a bag of white powder. That's, Where was that's the laundry room? Eric. The laundry room, do you remember, um, in grandmother's house, you go down the stairs, and then, because John's room was in there, you make a left to wash and dryer, and then to the immediate right was John's okay, room. Okay, so it was near John's. Okay, yeah. so, 
and, and what what time frame were they doing this? What, how old were they? Was this earlier on? Was this when they were well, younger? Paul was it? Blew off, Paul blew off college um, that Fred had, you know, worked hard to do to get the money so his kids could go to college, and then he just just blew it all off, and that was okay. Nineteen. Um, Oh, in the 70s. This was in the 70s. 70s. Okay, so this was before this was before I was on the scene. So this Oh yeah. So th- yeah. they weren't doing that anymore when uh, <laughs> No, 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 please tell me. I mean, at least not at that home. I mean, were they doing that at her home like in the 90s or the 80s? Were they doing it? They're doing it there. They're doing it everywhere. They were doing it in the 90s still. They were doing it when I was there. You were a baby when um we Moved in with Chandra and Paul. <laughs> and there was a snowstorm. And grandmother said, you know what? You guys get over here. I said, Mom, we're fine. Just leave. We'll, we'll be fine. And she said, no, I'm... She had somebody truck over and pack all the diapers and go over to grandmother's and just feel stressed out. And... Uh, so... That's my memory. She's not. I'm so sorry. Oh, Chandra got um, salmonella from the turkey. Who did? Paul's wife, Chandra. She got got salmonella. Yeah, she made the turkey dinner, and she got sick. (laughs) Oh, poor Chandra. God. I have reams and reams of memories. What else do you want to know? But I want to. I want to know if they were doing this. I want to know if they were doing this like when I was there. Like you were a baby. Okay, so by the, the time I was like a teenager, etc., they had not been doing this anymore. Is that right? I'm not sure if that's right or not. But they were definitely doing that at some point. They were doing. Oh yeah, when you do cocaine, you don't care where you are. <laughs> Okay, so just to give my audience a little bit of a background, this is a night. What was oh, what was it? Was it a, what was it? A six bedroom home? Well, one, two, three, four, five. Mine was um, mine was the last one. That's the one I told you. There's a full length mirror when you walk in. Okay, but okay, I'm trying to. With hey. a giant spider. Okay, uh, uh, we've already talked about that story. Okay, so I think it's a five-bedroom home. This is a five-bedroom home in Evergreen, Colorado. Um, we've got Susie on the line, my mom, and she comes from a big family, uh, seven, seven kids. More, more than just a large number of people. Seven They're kids, but but They're the thing is... people. <laughs> and now I've seven, become fat. Seven I, large people. She comes from an obese family. Now, I will say this... <laughs> The, the cocaine just did not do the trick on them, did they? Did it? Did, they needed to do more. And more and Mix more. that stuff with baking soda, but I will say this. <laughs> Get a pipe. Um, did, Regina, my grandmother... She didn't do it. Well... <laughs> she, she was a Democrat, and she was like an FDR Democrat, but this is a... For lack th- lack of a better better word, a conservative lady. Did she ever have a drink? You know what? She would have been I appalled. Do when we were, went to, she would have um, been Christmas appalled. In Omaha, Nebraska. She would drink, and I just loved how she was laughing and comfortable. But then she came home, and Fred did the drinking. He liked to drink. I remember him always a cigarette and a glass of wine. Great guy. But I will say this. I think we're running a little long. I want to do part two. Oh, the questions I have for you. Wow. Well, I don't want to be on right now. Okay. All right. We'll do that for next time. Pleasure. All right. Um, I love you, Augie. I'll see you later. Love you too. Bye.